Are you pro-human rights? Are you pro-peace? Are you pro-justice? Are you pro-humanity? Are you pro for people living in a world of dignity where all pe people, irrespective of their background, whether it's economic, religious, gender, um, ethnicity, race, nationality, that regardless of who you, we are, we are all God's children. We are all brought on in this earth the same way. We all leave the same way, and we all deserve to be treated equally. And that is really the core of the Palestinian human rights movement and the ability to advance Palestinian human rights. Um, I'm sure you guys have all seen the news, and recently with this administration, there has been um, quite a bit, the situation in Palestine, I, I mean, I won't paint a rosy or false picture, it's absolutely horrendous right now for Palestinians, the situation. And it has been for quite some time, of course, but at this point right now, what we've seen happening in Gaza, the situation in the West Bank, in Jerusalem for Palestinians is completely unacceptable. Um, I'm sure you know, I don't, maybe you know, but what happened in Gaza from March 30th till now, 135 unarmed Palestinian civilians have been killed by Israeli snipers, including six children, and um, including a woman who is a humanitarian aid worker who provided um, uh, not CPR, who provided humanitarian aid to people in Gaza. Yeah, a medical worker, excuse me. And including people of uh, the press were actually targeted and killed. Um, so it's really, really encouraging to be here tonight and despite of all that is horrific and that is going on, to see people here that are interested, to hear these stories, not only to hear them and educate ourselves with them, but be willing to talk to your friends or your parents or your kids' teachers or go to your school and have these open discussions about what is taking place and hopefully um, become an advocate for peace, for justice, because it's and for human rights, because um, I think it's a very important point, again, what Lisa said, that in order to achieve peace, we need to achieve a world where we have justice for all people, not a select group of people. And again, this is the core of what it means to advance the Palestinian human rights cause. And so I really thank you and appreciate you being here tonight, and I very much look forward to all of your questions. Please, please, please don't be shy. Um, I, I can see this is a very respectful, kind, caring environment and audience, so I know everybody will, will all be respectful of each other, and I really look forward to the engaging discussion that we can have. So thank you so much.